Hello, Gialenta. I have chosen you to be the very first one to take advantage of uh, what I've said on my Facebook page, Lewis May Be the Living Well. And uh, what I'm going to be doing for you is answering your question. I don't do cards in a typical reading, but this is just more of a visual thing for you to connect with me over this video. So that's why I have the cards. Now, I've already pre shuffled them for you, and one card popped out in particular. So before that, I'm going to tell everyone that's going to be watching what your question is. And your question's about your job uh, with love prospects and how are they going to be developing. So as I was shuffling the, the deck of cards, and by the way, I'm using the Archangel Oracle deck by uh, Doreen Virtue. Uh, Doreen has many cards out there, and I think they're fun. And cards can be fun. They, they're a good way to, you know, kind of point people in the direction that they need to be pointed to sometimes. And... You know, you take it with a grain of salt, of course, but at the same time, I think you're going to be pretty amazed. Um, anyway, so as, as I was shuffling the card and, and going over your question inside my head, one of the cards pop out. And whenever a card pops out out of a deck, it, it's a pay attention to. It, this is a, a very important thing for you to be focusing on um, before we get into the reading. So the card that popped out was, um, remember who you are. Archangel Michael it represents this card. So you are a powerful, loving, creative child of God. You are very loved. So that's what the card looks like. And what this is meaning to me is make sure that you remember who you are. Sometimes when people get into relationships that they, uh, they want to fit in so badly or, or they, they, so they tend to bend or they tend not to be who they are and, and, and change to adapt. And just remember that someone has to become to you and, and focus on, you know, a mutual understanding of each other. So don't lose yourself in a process of finding yourself in a career, a new career and a new love life. So anyway, so what I've been, so what I did is I, like I said, I, I pre-shuffled these with your question in my mind. I'm going to pick out five. Oh, and one popped out again. All right, so I'm just going to take a look at this and see where, what the sequence is like. And uh, hmm. well, this is a uh, this is something that's going to be coming around you quite often throughout the next year to year and a half um, and I'll I'll tell you what the cards are about and then I'll do my input so the first card is you are safe again our angel Michael represents this and he says that you are he's protecting you against lower energies and guarding uh, your loved ones yourself and your home okay so this means to me that you that you um, are in a lot of conflict right now and the conflict is coming through um, with this undecidedness of, of what you should be doing with your career. I personally think that you are in the right field. You might need to be moving in a, in a, uh, um, a different uh, physical location, but I really do feel like you found your calling. You're a very big people person, and so you're, you're, you're able to balance, each, uh, balance people and, and bring justice to people. So I really, really do feel like this is going to be a career that you should stay in. You can expand on it, but I, I just feel like this is a time for you to really um, focus more so on getting the benefit from what you do. The next card is you are safe. Oh, sorry. Uh, next card is that healthy lifestyle. And uh, Archangel Raphael is this card and eat a healthful diet, get adequate sleep and exercise regular for optimal health. So so this is also indicating to me that again take care of yourself. Make sure that your needs are met first. It's it don't sacrifice something in order for you to think that you're going to be happy because the happiness will probably only be for a shorter period of time. But when you're and I'm talking more about with love life here, when you are going into this system of of, of a new relationship, you have to come into it healthy. You have got to come into it with your eyes wide open and an expectation of certain things. So don't bend. Don't 
be in, in unhealthy relationships because it's just not going to work. Third card is comfort. Um, I am with you in a time of need, helping your heart to heal. Okay? And so this is also representing something from your past. And, and you don't want to repeat about your past. And you're not going to have it as long as, again, you're healthy. So stay in your healthy zone. And, and the fourth card that I'm going to tell you about is kind of going back to the very first thing about what I said to you about making sure that you stay in this field because it's a very powerful field for you and you need to really work with it and find that joy that you should have. And this card is Prosperity. And it's Archangel Ariel. Your material needs are provided as, as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So there's this card right here. And Prosperity, you're going to have it all. You're going to have the money. You are going to have... Um, the comfort of having a solid healthy relationship it's just a timing issue right now and right now you got to really clean your clutter out you know I, I get the sense that you're so overwhelmed and so consumed with everything that's going on that you need to take a step back from it and, and enjoy life for a change and instead of always trying to see every every single thing as a stop and go motion is like is this it is this it is this it and you just need to slow it down and enjoy the process you're very impatient. Stop it. Uh, last card is Life Review. Uh, Jeremiah is the angel for this one. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. I think I just said that. So, but this card can also be represented by having you, uh, again, put yourself in perspective. Get rid of this pent up energy that's not really good for you and relax enjoy life y you you started a new chapter with with uh, your career and your career is is going to blossom and and i feel like there's a partner around you that's going to be very very detrimental in a very good way uh so we're going to say detrimental but your partner's going to be very good for your business and is going to help bring you the uh, prosperity that you've been looking for and on the love line front, give it some time. Heal yourself. Get yourself healthy. Get to a place where you need it to go and really enjoy it because that's when uh, the man of your dreams is going to be entering in your life. Six months. Give it about six months and you're going to be able to, and then you're going to be fine. You know, it, it's, it's all about timing for you right now and you can't force time and you've been trying to manipulate it a little bit. So just slow it down, enjoy the day-to-days, -day and you're going to be much happier. So I hope I answered your question, and I really look forward to uh, having all of this come true for you. And so enjoy the day. It's a gorgeous day in uh, Greece, and so au revoir.